Good morning guys, well good afternoon, whichever time it is for you guys right now. Let me take you out of this room because this room's a little dark. Ignore everything behind me, I'm in the middle of sorting it. Guys, today's video, I'm going to explain to you what happened. And when I say what happened, um, if a lot of you can't tell, I've been off YouTube for a few days. <laughs> um, let me explain everything, I know I look a bit plot blotchy i've just put tan on but i put tan on earlier so everything's still dry and i haven't washed it off yet and my hair i need to re-dye my hair um okay enough about me let me explain everything that's happened so on tuesday last week let me find out the date on i'll tell you the exact dates guys i want to tell you the exact story of what actually happened because i feel like you will need to learn know what's going on um okay so when did this get uploaded? I'm going to say the 27th. So on the 27th, early hours in the morning, I uploaded a video. Um, it was about 2 o'clock in the morning, something around that, about 2, 3 o'clock in the morning. I uploaded the video. And that video I was expecting to upload and everything was going to go smooth, everything was going to go perfect. I uploaded the video, the video got uploaded, the video started getting views and everything was going good, guys. That video was a video of me explaining to you guys or teaching you guys on how to become a YouTuber, how to become successful on YouTube, sharing little tips to help other people who was in my position, who's wanted to become a YouTuber and make it successful, giving little tips on how to do that because a lot of people ask me on a daily basis, you know, how do you become successful on YouTube? So I thought I'd make a video just to explain all, all it, it all. So I made the video, it took me hours to make, it took me hours to upload, just put it this way guys it took me like three days to edit this video it took me ages i put so much time so much effort into that video that i was expecting it to do absolutely amazing i uploaded it on the 27th on the tuesday early hours in the morning about three o'clock before going to sleep yes i cannot sleep until our video is uploaded and that day i missed an upload so i needed to get a video up i uploaded the video and all went perfect woke up the next morning i had an email off youtube I'm sorry to tell you, but your channel has got a strike. Um, you cannot upload, you cannot do anything on YouTube for one week. And I was like, what the hell? What, whoa, what's going on? I haven't done anything wrong. What is going on here? So I went online, I spoke to YouTube through the chat that I have available on my YouTube channel. I spoke to them and asked them like, what's going on? What's the score? I ha can, can you at least tell me what I've done wrong so I don't do it again in the future? Because that's all I had was an email saying you have been blocked. I didn't know anything else. I didn't have any other clue what was going on. So I asked the YouTube team. The YouTube team took it on into their their um, their hands, I guess, and got back to me and told me that someone has reported one of my videos as spam. The video that was reported is the newest upload that I done, which was teaching you guys how to become a YouTuber. Someone has gone onto my YouTube channel and decided to go ahead and put a report in against that video. I don't know why, I don't know what I've done wrong, I don't know why people or someone has this little envy on me. I guess it's because you you can see me doing well and that's not what you want. I, I guess that's what's going on here, but I, I, I could be wrong. I could be wrong, but that's what I'm guessing. So I was like, okay, okay, no problem. Now I need to, I need to appeal this because that's wrong. This video is not spam. This video is not doing anything wrong. I need to, I, you know, I, I need to get back onto YouTube. It's my job and this is my only source of income at the moment. So they got back to me. I, I, they said appeal against it. So that's what I'd done. And I never heard anything off them. I couldn't, I couldn't go any further than that appeal. And I was stuck off being off YouTube for a week. And when I got unreleased off YouTube, which your, which was the video of me moving, that was the first video I uploaded. Uh, that video did absolutely amazing. I'm amazed at how good that video is doing. But that video was unfortunately one of my videos that I managed to upload because moving into this new house. I haven't got internet. I have the Wi-Fi haven't been uploaded yet. Well, they've installed it, but they're saying that we can't get connection and they need to sort it out soon because I need to get back to reactions. So tomorrow we're hopefully gonna sort the internet out and I'll be able to upload reactions again. So please bear with me for the next like 
couple of days, couple of hours, um, we are getting it sorted. I am trying my best to get this sorted. I've told the internet company, you know, I, I rely on the internet to do my job, so I need the internet back. Um, so yes, yeah, someone, whoever you are, that went onto my channel and decided to say one of my videos is spam, then well done, you achieved what you wanted to achieve. You got me blocked on YouTube for a week, um, and if I get reported again, then I'm done on YouTube. And I'm I'm gutted. I'm I'm gutted that someone has taken the time out and reported one of my videos. To be honest with you, because I you know I I'm doing this as something. I'm doing this because I wanted to do it for as long as I can remember. I'm doing this because I'm passionate about it, and I don't understand why people have. I guess jealousy, I guess the jealousy comes in a lot on why people report you and stuff like that. So yeah, that's a little update guys. That's the reason why I haven't been uploading. I am, I've made a second YouTube channel for a backup. Now I don't want to, I don't want to, and I mean I do not want to upload to another YouTube channel. I'm enjoying this channel, you guys are enjoying this channel, you guys are enjoying my reactions, you're enjoying my vlogs, you're enjoying getting to know who I am, and moving into this house has given me full motivation to vlog. Moving into this house has given me full motivation to upload videos as much as I can, and being off YouTube was such a disheartening thing. Like. When I got when I got that email, I literally I, I broke down and cried. I was like, no, this cannot be happening. Please do not let this happen. I cannot this cannot happen. And yeah, it happened. And I had a week of YouTube. Do not get me wrong. I've kind of enjoyed that week of YouTube. In that week of YouTube, I went hiking with my boyfriend. Um, we hiked the hook like a lot of, as far as we could of the Gower. Um, you know, I've, I've enjoyed being able to settle into my house before having to record in here and stuff like that because I'm, I'm in the middle of sorting my room now so that I can start recording tomorrow. So yeah, it, it's been a nice break, but I was absolutely gutted when I got told that I've got to ha got, come off YouTube for a week. I I cried and I was absolutely devastated. I, it's not the fact that I couldn't record, it's not the fact that I couldn't upload. It was more of the fact that I felt like I was letting 16,000 people down. Like that's what done me most was the fact that I'm letting all you guys down and I didn't want to, I don't want to let, I don't want to let you guys down. Like, you know, I see you guys as my family now. You guys are my second family. So, well, my third. I have, I have quite a lot of families, guys. <laughs> but yeah, you're my third. In that meantime, in the break, I managed to hit, the, say, the, here we go, here we go. The day I hit 16,000 subscribers, I got blocked. In my break, I managed to hit 17,000 subscribers. I'm over the moon. I'm absolutely like, oh my God, 17,000 people have subscribed to my YouTube channel. Like, thank you so much. Even when I look like this, you guys are still saying I'm rocking it, even when I look like this, guys. Um... So yeah, and we hit 17,000, so hopefully in June, three weeks time, I'm going away on holiday, guys. We were going to go to York, um, but things changed, and we've decided to go to London for four days, and then leave London, go to Fort Park, uh, spend a night in Fort Park, and then come home the next day. So we're still going for the, for the week, but we're changing it up a bit, we're doing different things. So I am going to vlog it all, you guys are going to come along with me. I need to pick up the courage to pick up the camera, but... To be honest with you, I think doing it in London isn't going to be a problem because London is like LA of the UK. Like, if you're a celebrity or if you're someone big, you know, London's the place to go. And I know a lot of YouTubers are from London. Um, personally, I know personal YouTubers from London as well. So, I guess London shouldn't be a problem with me recording. People aren't going to look at me stupid. Like, I've walked around with a camera around here, I get so many weird looks. Let me show you my wardrobe. I'm absolutely chuffed, guys. First ever walking wardrobe, and we're making it work. It's so cool. Okay, so there's no light. Like, it's a cupboard, there's no light. We fitted a light with a light switch, so I don't even have to like bend down to the lights right here because it's the other side, but you, you know what I mean. I could just go boom on. Uh, it's all been painted. This wall paper I couldn't get off, so I've just left it on there. Um, we've just painted over it. It'll do, it'll do. I'm going to try and get a mirror to come down here. Um, but we have boxes with shelves on. Well, oh my god, boxes with shelves on. Shelves with boxes on. Um, 
that's all our underwear and everything. Then we have like sprays and all this kind of stuff. And once I once I empty the rest of the boxes, then these shelves will probably be filled full of a lot of different things. Um, then we have two rails that he's put up. Dan's put up right here. Um, we have pajamas, t-shirts, 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 dresses, dresses, guys. Lakers, my Lakers dress, I love it. Um, and then we have trousers, joggers, trousers, joggers, work clothes, and hoodies. So yeah, oh, and shoes, and shoes. So yeah, this is the wardrobe. I'm, I'm over the moon, over the moon. Now my plan is to sort out this room, and I mean, I, I mean it needs to. So I'm, I'm not even going to show you the room because I'm embarrassed. But I need to sort out this room. I need to get a setup going to start recording to be honest with you what i might do is get rid of my desk i bought a desk if you guys haven't seen then go back a couple of vlogs and you'll see the desk that i brought but um but it's too big it's too big for this room i can fit it in but i can't fit anything else in so i need to remove the desk and hopefully get a like a smaller desk so i'm gonna might i'm i don't know i might keep it i might keep it or i might sell it i don't know I figure something out. I figure something out. That's that's the main goal is figuring something out, and I will figure something out. And I need to go for all them boxes. My TV is just too big for this room as well. My TV is hidden underneath that shelf right there. My TV is too big for this room. So I've got a lot of work to do. I've got a hell of a lot to work to do. Do you mind? I've got a hell of a lot of work to do, but it's worth it. This room is nice and the wardrobes, I like the wardrobe. <laughs> I've got organisation of the wardrobe, I love it. This is all I've ever wanted in my life, was a walking wardrobe. Yeah, it needs, I, 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 I kind of miss the paint here and you know, yeah, but it, it'll do, it'll do, it'll do, it'll do. Okay, um, I'm really not sure what's going to be in the rest of this vlog. Um, I'm going to try and I gotta remember to turn the light off. I'm gonna sort this room out, so I might show you a little setup video later um, of what I come up with. That's even if I come up with anything. Hopefully, I do come up with something. So I might show you a little um, setup vlog later of everything that's up and going. But for that, guys, I think this is the end of me for this little video. So uh, yeah, well, I don't know. Whatever's after this, guys, appreciate it. I love you all. You're all beautiful, you're all amazing, stay true to yourself, keep going, no matter what happens, no matter who comes in your way, no matter what hater comes in your way, keep going, because they dislike my videos, I get dislikes on my videos constantly, I get people who are very jealous of me, people who want to be in the position that I am, and you get blocked for it, like, screw you. Guys, I love you all, peace. Bye. Okay. I need to sort this room. I don't even know where to begin. I'm not even know, I'm not even sure how to even manage all this. There is a hell of a lot of stuff here. I think a lot of it needs to go out. I have one shelf cleared. Well, pretty much cleared. I don't even know where to go. I don't know where to put it. I, I kind of like it there because it's such an easy, like it fits so perfectly, but it also fits perfectly there. But I don't know how much room I have for there. I have no idea what to do with this stuff. Like, there's so much stuff. Like, for two people, we have a lot of stuff. For two people. More than what I thought we had. Ooh, what a double chin. I'm just gonna ask... Oh my god, why am I so red? I'm just gonna ask a nice simple question. Why did they say that moving was gonna be easy? This is not easy. Okay. All this... It's just empty boxes of rubbish. That box but there, it's all gonna go onto my desk once I've moved my desk. That box, I have no idea what that box even contains. Them bags, no idea. But we're getting somewhere. We've got the shelf filled. Um, I need Dan to sort out the bottom bit. It's just all bits that I don't know what to do with. Now I face the struggle of where to put my desk. If I put it here, I have some good natural lighting, to be honest with you. Or if I put it here, yeah, I think I'm better off staying here, and I... Yeah, I'm much better. Okay. 